Hi guys, Chris FPV here and I'm back with another video and today as you can see I have the Taronix QX7 over here in my hands and I'm going to show you today how to install OpenTX Companion and update the version of the transmitter. So what we have to do right now is to go to your internet browser and type in opentx.org then you come to this this site so here you can find a manuals document to donation downloads and all that stuff but the first page that's that's the page that we want you come you scroll down to news and here you can see the latest version was 16 December 2017 OpenTX 2.2.1 you want to click on that and then you come all the way down here are the files that you want so I have a Windows computer so I'll choose OpenTX Companion 2.2.1 Windows installer if you ha have a Mac or something like that you come you choose the right one so I will choose Windows installer it it will be the same and you have to wait for it to download okay when it is done downloading you want to install it on your computer so on Windows you click just open and you get this you click on yes click on agree next next and install it will install on your computer finish and now it is done it will just open it says the ultimate transmitter companion 2.2 when it opens it will give you this pop-up just click on ok and here in the edit settings you want to choose QX7 or X7 menu EN is English and yeah here you, you can choose your mode right here choose your channel order I think my channel order is A E R T um, check these two boxes and click on OK so when it is done we want to just get a transmitter in bootloader mode and how you do that is um put these trims um inside like that and switch on the transmitter here you, you can see qx7 bootloader 2.2 and it says right firmware or restore eprom exit and uh, um beneath you see or plug in USB cable and that that is what we are going to do now so what you have to do is here you get your micro USB cable and you plug it in just like this it says USB connected you come back to the computer so when it is connected first um, you click on read models and settings from radio here you can see model 01 so it shows that the transmitter is properly connected you can close that then you can you have to come to this download button here and click on download firmware so what i will do now is create a new folder for all my stuff so i'll come to, i'll go to downloads you don't have to do this but i, I just want to get my files organized so I'll name it open tx and open it um i'll also make another and name it firmware like that open it and you can save your file there and then it will ask you do you want to write a firmware to the radio now click on yes um yeah and then you click on write to tx click on okay So when it says flashing done, it means that OpenTX 2.2.1 is now flashed on your radio. So you can 
close this and disconnect it and go to exit let me show you that it is properly installed so phrase safe is not set click on ok sd card we haven't installed the drivers for the sd card we'll do it later i'll show you guys how to do it click on ok and then now hold the menu button click page till we see version you can also come back by holding the page button so version it says open tx version right here 2.2.1 into bracket cca 71808 yeah so guys that was my video for today thumbs up if you like this video subscribe and stay tuned